what's up guys early morning here on sunday late september launching out of bill's marina so uh we're gonna be going for some uh speckled trout today specifically trout and drum but uh we're gonna try to get on some trout today so we got some minnows got some peeler crab go out here and float some corks do some casting around some flats and just see what's out there it's blowing a gale today uh it's 10 to 15 so on those kind of days man a really good tip is to make sure you stay on the calm side of the river so i'm gonna head across the york river over to mob jack and just get out of the wind since it's blowing northwest but uh hopefully it pays off we'll see stick around all right guys first cast of the morning fish hooked up i don't know what it is yet it's either gonna be a trout or a drum i can tell you that let's see what we got wants to go around the boat so we're gonna let him Ooh, what we got what we got put the drum i don't know if he's gonna be a keeper or not it's the smallest one i've caught in two weeks let's go ahead and put our anchor down Pole anchors are the best. Highly recommended. There you go. First fish of the day on the first cast. I think it's gonna be a good day. Hopefully there's some bigger ones in the uh, school year. And we will see. Got a nice fish right here. I don't know what it is. It's a good one. He's taking me all the way down the shoreline over there. Wow. Caught him right here off this point. This is going to be a big drum. Got him with a circle hook, so he should be staying put. We'll see. Hopefully it's not a ray. Kind of feels like a ray. Feels heavy, heavy, heavy. Oh, there's a, nah, it's a fish. Oh yeah, hopefully it goes towards the boat. Let's keep him going towards the boat. Let's keep him going towards the boat. See if I can get in there and get the net. feels like a good fish oh this feels like a good one yeah it's a big drum nice drum oh slammer of a drum i saw him in here chasing i turned the heat on yeah that's a good one let's see if we can bring right up to that Look at that guy. That is a good one. He might be over slot. We'll check him out and see what they're working with here. There you go, just walking down the shoreline. Saw some bait jumping back in there, so I said, well, let me get out and walk the shoreline and see if, uh, see if I can put the sneak on him since I don't have a trolling motor on this boat. There you go. Let's see how long he is. He is going to be 24. He is a keeper. We got another peeler crab down there. There you go. That's all I'm using, just a back corner. And I always break the legs off 
to make sure that a little more compact form. And where there's one of those guys, there's gonna be more. So let's uh, see if we can get on another one in here. All right, so there you have it. A limit of drum off of two peeler crabs. Some beautiful fish, all 24 to 25 and a half. Exactly where you want them to keep them to eat. They're eating on this uh, this peeler crab. That's it right there, guys. Um, wow, what a quick morning of fishing. I was hoping to do a little bit more of that, but uh, I don't want to sit here and just catch these fish to release them. So I'm going to call a couple friends and see if maybe a buddy wants to come back out here with me. And uh, I'll let him catch his limit too. But we'll see. Get out there. Catch these fish, man. They are so much fun to catch on light tackle. They are a ball. Just got a hold of Dwayne, and uh, I'm gonna fly back to the ramp, pick him up. We're gonna put him on his three, if we can, if they're still here when we get back. We'll see, stay tuned. Good going, Island. Buzzing on back in. All right, so we're back at Mills Marina, and we're just uh, waiting on the crewmate. He was uh, cooking breakfast when I called him, so he should be here any minute. If I'm lucky, maybe he brought me some breakfast, but I doubt it. All right, we got Dwayne in the boat finally. We're gonna go back out here and try to do it all over again. We'll see what happens. Hopefully the fish are still there. We're about, we've been gone for about 30 minutes, so hopefully they hadn't moved yet chasing bait. They were, they were on it. All right, we're back at it, and Dwayne is hooked up with a nice one. Don't muscle him, because you're on 10 pound line. <laughs> How long have we been here, Dwayne? Two minutes. <laughs> oh, I love this stuff right here. That's what it's all about. Uh, you're taking a chance leaving your bobber in the water. Oh, well. <laughs> We'll go find your rod if it, if it takes off. It's coming right. <laughs> oh God! Watch this fish. Dude, if that thing takes off. You, you gotta get my rod. Just flip the bail on it. I'm telling you, dude. There's drum everywhere. All right, get him on into shore, down to this little cubby right here. If he goes around the corner, don't let him break you off on the muscles, okay? Oh, that's a good one. Oh, bring him right up in here. Come to Poppy. Oh, yeah. Oh, he doesn't want to go yet. Bring him on. Oh, yeah. Look at that slab. Oh, even got to keep your crab on that one. Wow. All right. That is a stout fish. Look at the spots on that one, too, man. He's covered in spots. All right, go measure him off. Make sure he's not 26. Hey, look at the blue in that tail. Come around. Blue is gorgeous. Holy cow, that's a pretty one, dude. All right. Put him in the cool. Another fish hooked up. Oh, he's burning drag on Dwayne. Let him take it. Let him take it. Oh. He's going for the long haul, bro. Go walk down here and drill at the same time. Yeah, if you want to. Because he's going in that creek. Yeah. He's going for a ride, dude. That might be a big one. I'm waiting for us to catch one that's over. I don't want to get too far from the boat because I got a cork in the water. I don't want to get spooled. Man, these fish are just stacked up on these points, guys. If you want to catch the drum, target them on the points. That's a nice one too, dude. I just saw them come up. They are in here thick, Bubba. Whew. Love that. Big tail slaps. Oh, yeah. That's a good one, Dwayne. Ah, 
he might not be done yet. Oh, he might not fit in the net. He don't like what he sees. Turn his head. There it is, another stud. That one might be over 28, 26, guys. Wait, aren't you glad you uh, got the phone oh, call this morning? Phone. Yeah, me too, man. Drop you off back at the dock in another 45 minutes? Yeah. Your wife ain't gonna know what to expect. <laughs> Y'all go to the fish market? <laughs> man, another pretty fish get tired of saying pretty fish he's an okay fish there it is I cannot stress the importance of a circle hook every time right in the corner of the mouth we have not gut hooked one fish every fish we didn't keep has been released look at that Dwayne, can you keep it down over there? I'm trying to record. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Hit the water and boom. Uh, they're here. either there or they're not, you know? All right, we are hooked up again. Need my cameraman, Dwayne. Cameraman, cameraman. Yeah. Oh, dude, this is a good one. She is pulling good. You see me lock my elbow in there, you know it's a good one. Water action out there, oh. There it is. Yeah, this one's trying to go back out. Mine was trying to go in. He's coming back to the boat for us. Beautiful. Get it. I like it. He's trying. He got some. Right there, sure. Yeah. Get oh, that on there. Yeah. Look at the size of the dot on that one's tail. Look at that. That's got like a Paula Abdul birthmark. <laughs> oh man. Look at this. You can't make this stuff up. Nice fish, Blair. Look at that. Look at that one. Oh. Right down there. That's a good one. It don't seem like a. Uh, oh, yeah. oh, yeah. It's a big drum. Oh, there's another one with them. Another one with it. I ain't never seen that before. Bring them on in. Bring them on in. They're fighting over that peeler crab. Maybe I can net two with one shot. Awesome. All right, here we go. Bring around this corner. Get him up in. There you go. Hoss him a little bit. I can't see him. He's on the he's on the bank. He hung up on the bank. All right, bring him over here. There it is. We go get another piece of peeler. All right, Dwayne's just catching this one for fun today. We are limited out. Oh man, they jumped out the cooler. <laughs> we got them flopping <laughs> in the boat. They're leaping out the cooler over there. Oh man. They want us to have our two man limit. He's like, put me back. Put me back in, coach. Look at this, man. You walk away from the boat for one second. And they're trying to break out the damn cooler. Look at that. That is how it's done. That is a pile of drum. That's going to be some good eating. I see tacos in the future. Ow! Get out there and catch them. All right, guys, that is a wrap. We uh, limited out this morning, came back, 
got my buddy on a limit and uh we're gonna leave them chewing and hopefully come back tomorrow and do the same thing again and those they should be somewhere close by they won't be in the same spot but they'll be somewhere around here you just gotta find them put the time in find the fish if they're there they're gonna eat instantly on this peeler crab if you don't get a hit move on all right we're back in mills marina at the uh courtesy fishing table you want to launch your boat at a nice boat ramp this is it right here guys 10 bucks well worth it you don't have to worry about dealing with all the yahoos at the public ramp. <laughs>